Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. My name is AJ Orbach, and I am the co-founder of Triple Whale. Today marks a momentous occasion at the intersection of data analytics, artificial intelligence, and e-commerce. As we've witnessed ChatGPT take the world by storm, a burning question has remained. How can AI transform our businesses? We know that ChatGPT can tell funny jokes and write great poems, but when will it help all of us make more money? The answer to these questions converge in what I'm about to unveil. We're launching the next generation of Triple Whale, an innovation set to redefine your experience with data, and it is going to blow your mind. This leap wasn't just an upgrade. As we'll soon explain, it required radical rethinking at every level, data processing, first party data collection, and large language model innovation. Our ambition, to unlock the vast potential of data and AI, empowering you to scale your businesses to new heights. However, achieving this vision meant breaking free from conventional paradigms of how data is leveraged in the decision-making process. Small businesses, for example, suffer from data overload, from not knowing how to leverage the right data to scale their businesses. Larger businesses aren't spared either. Their reliance on a disjointed toolkit for first-party data collection, data warehouses, complex ETL processes, and analytical tools is not just costly, but cumbersome. The real challenge though, isn't about setup or management costs, because even with these tools, the lack of cohesion and common definition for data points makes it impossible for any large language model to be utilized effectively. Our mission has been to empower you to build the business of your dreams. And our belief is that data and AI are the vehicles to help you achieve those goals. Since our inception in 2021, and especially over the last year, our focus has been relentless. First, build a unified data language for e-commerce, thereby enabling it to be accessible for AI. Second, infusing first-party data into every facet of your business. Third, innovating at the cutting edge of the AI revolution. And today, we are unveiling the most powerful large language model for e-commerce. We have fine-tuned the model, allowing us to achieve the most accurate data retrieval system on the planet. This matters. Why? Because this means that you have instant access to any answer you need in order to scale your business. But there's more. This also means that you have a new team member, one that can reason with your data, give you recommendations, and think with you. To be honest, we did not expect it to be this good. And now I'm excited to unveil the magic. Let's start with a use case that's near and dear to my heart. Every morning I used to pull up the creatives for Madison Braids, which is the brand that me and Max used to work on. And I tried to see which ads are doing the best, which creatives do I need to scale, which do I need to tune down and write new creatives. And I'm going to ask Moby right now to pull up all of my creatives, top 10 highest spending, and then give me all these metrics around them, which is just astonishing that I can just ask Moby to do it and he will pull up a report for me. Now, amazing. Look at this. This is beautiful. I got the ROAS. I got the NC ROAS. I got the CPM. I got the ad copy and the images in a table. Now I'm going to ask it another question, which I, I, I wanted to do this when I was running Madison, but I never really did this. Can you break out the personas of my store using the ad copy above? And now Moby is just going to read the ad copy that it has in the previous prompt, and it's going to break out the personas of this store. Whew. This is amazing. Okay. Now let's wait. Let's finish. First of all, these personas look exactly like the personas of my store which is amazing. Okay, so now I'm gonna ask it, using persona number two, can you write me five new ad copies and add emojis to them? And now Moby's gonna go ahead and just, just like that, it's writing me these copies and it is adding in emojis. And these are copies that are better than what I would, would write for Madison Braids back in the day. Amazing. Okay, now this is actually something that I would do every 
single day if I could. So we've built that for you right now in Triple Whale. So basically I can take this exact sequence, right? Essentially there's a sequence. I ask a question, then I asked Moby to break down the personas, and then I asked Moby to write copy around that. I can go ahead and save this sequence so I have it for later. Now I'll show you guys how this actually looks in the boards. So I actually built one of these already. So if I go into my creative board, I have that exact query I just ran before. Copy the images and the spend ROAS, NC ROAS and everything else. But on the side here, I have the AI writing me every day five new copies that are just ready to go. Holy moly. At Triple Well, we are the best in the world at providing you accurate information around your attribution. We offer a variety of different attribution models, but it's always been tough to parse through exactly which attribution model you should use. And are there differences between different attribution models on specific campaigns? And pulling out those gems took a lot of tedious work and time. And so over here, I built a dashboard with three of my different attribution models in one dashboard, which is beautiful. But instead of me parsing through them and trying to understand what I should do, I'm just gonna grab and ask Moby. Can you tell me, based on the data in this dashboard, which attribution models I should scale up and scale down and use all the attribution models in this dashboard? And just like that, Moby's gonna parse through all the data magically. And it's telling me which campaigns to scale up. So this campaign looks good on all attribution models. Amazing. This campaign only looks good on triple attribution, but overall it's below performance on the other ones. So you should scale it down. That is just going to save me money, you money, and so much time. And so I couldn't be more excited to get this in all of your hands. Okay. So now I'm going to start with a use case that's near and dear to my heart, which is planning the future. So when I was running Madison Braids with Max and we hit the COVID bump, we went from 500K a month to 1.5 million a month. And we bought a lot of inventory, assuming we're gonna be at 3 million a month in revenue. And a lot of that inventory is still sitting in a warehouse somewhere. Max can explain where exactly. Um, we would have saved a ton of headache and a ton of time if we could just see the future. And that's what we're doing here. So the first question I'm asking is, give my revenue and ROAS over the last 12 months by month. I wanna see the history. Now I'm going to ask it using the last 24 months of data, forecast the future. And as you see, the AI spit out a beautiful forecast. What you're seeing over here is my historical revenue and my historical prediction of what we would have predicted your revenue to be. And as you can see, the trend is spot on. You can also see the future in the lighter green color, which is what does the AI think and what does Moby think I'm going to do in the future? Then below that, I'm going to ask the AI again, give me my ROAS over the next six months using the last 24 months of data. And this is also spot on. Again, green is historical prediction. Blue is what actually happened. And you can see they're so close. And over here, you can see the green lines, the light green lines are the future. Now, using all that data, my history and the forecast of ROAS and the forecast of revenue, I'm going to ask Moby what I should be doing over the next six months or year. And it's going to break it down to ad strategy, inventory management, and other insights. This is just amazing. The forecast suggests an upward trend in ROAS peaking in July. This indicates the period of high effectiveness in ad spend. Capitalize on this by increasing ad budget gradually from April because you need an increase from April in order to capitalize it on July. It is, it is crazy. I'm so excited to get this in, into all your hands. It's really, it's really crazy. The examples I showed above are just a tiny fraction of what you all can do today with Triple Whale's AI and the new platform. As AI becomes more powerful, we are here to ensure that you are equipped with the most advanced AI to scale your business. We believe that these tools will empower you to become more successful. Today is just the beginning. We are in this together, let's go.